What's up, you guys? Y'all know who it is. It's your boy, Mike HB. Back here, y'all, with another tutorial video. Today, I'm going to be talking about Lua Fusion and giving a little uh, insights and after stuff that I use for chroma key or green screening. Like, some of the stuff that I use, I actually get it directly from YouTube. Um, people might call it stealing or whatever, but I have a screen recorder on my phone. So if something is green screened on YouTube, I slide my phone up, hit the record button, get it, take it to Luma Fusion, hit the Groma key, green screen on it, and do my little feature. Some of y'all might not even know or understand what I'm talking about. Let's jump right into the iPhone, you guys, so I can show you exactly how I do this. Okay, you guys, so the first thing you need to do is to open up YouTube and type in, in the search bar, type in green screen and then whatever you're looking for maybe you're looking for an intro maybe you're looking for a transition maybe you're looking for effects just type green screen and then whatever you're looking for and then a list like you see here will pop up of different people who have made videos of green screen so you can go and screen record on your iPhone or uh, 7 plus or whatever device you have that can do screen recording you can screen record I like this girl right here I like how she get right to the point let you know her name let you know how you know what she's editing and then go ahead and get right to the point. Today she's going to be doing the iPhone thing that you just seen in my video right here. So all you got to do, like I said, is, is green, uh, screen record it. Once you screen record it, drop it on into LumaFuse and bring it into LumaFuse. Cut the part that you want. And then once you do that, go over here right next to the star, the second from the last one. It's a little key. To click on that and hit green screen key. Once you hit green screen key, you can see kind of the green move away. Now around the edges, you got to go down here and mess with the brightness range, the saturation range, and also the hue range. So that way you can really get a nice crisp picture and see exactly what's going on. So let's move around and play with these a little bit. See what we can come up with. See that that's too much. So let's bring it back down. Mm, right there. Yeah, right there. So there you go. So now you got that effect. Let me do it one more time for you guys. Here's another clip. Green screen. Come over here at the key. Green screen key. There you go. Now it's time to play with these ranges and get them just the way we need them. Let's see. Uh, that back. I really need to play this. Let me let me play this real quick. Okay. See, that was too much. See, I, I'm not a, a professional with this either. I just go around and I play around with the different ranges to get the video exactly the way I want it, and then I put it on top of my video. And you got to make sure it is on top of your videos for it to work. So here go three of the ones I did. I did a subscribe button. That is the iPhone one, and then the end of that one. All right, you guys, that's all I have for you guys today. If you like this video, if it helped you out in any kind of way, please give a thumbs up, man. If it didn't help you, if you don't like the video, please give a thumbs down. I like those too. I like it all. If you're not subscribed to this channel, if you're here and if you're new to this channel, please subscribe to my channel. Here at this channel, man, I do a lot of tutorials about Luma Fusion, GarageBand, and even some Final Cut Pro and Logic Pro. Anything to pretty much do production to get your music or your brand out there. I do it here, right here at Feel Good Music with Mike Ishb. So until next time, you guys, I'm out. Remember, always be creative.